So you get into your vehicle, you fire up the engine, and you're off. But what most drivers don't realize is that in over 90% of vehicles on the road, there is a box inside the dashboard taking note of every move. They're very similar to the sorts of black boxes that you'd find in planes. Uh, they don't collect voice or images like the ones in planes do. The National Highway Transportation Safety Administration wants to require the event data recorders in all new cars by 2014. So every time you step into your car, and you put your foot in the accelerator, or you press the brake, it becomes a part of your digital driving history. Now the question is, is that a privacy issue? It's a privacy issue because NHTSA has not uh, imposed caps on the amount of data that can be collected. That's a star DSP caller on the line. For Georgia State Patrolman Lieutenant Wade Chafin, the data from the box helps turn a vehicle into an objective witness. We want that information. It could either, you know, pretty much implicate somebody that's violated a law or it could exonerate somebody. And all of this connects and hooks us to your vehicle. With um, old-fashioned police and work and the data recorder, more and more investigators are using the technology, especially in cases that involve fatalities. Um, naturally, in a crash, a lot of these components are disrupted, so we have to know several different ways of obtaining that information. The information can reveal engine speed, whether seat belts were buckled, and more. And moving forward, the recorders could have potential impacts on insurance and possibly even your rates. If insurance companies want to ask uh, drivers consent to collect data like that, absolutely. But it should be only with the driver's consent, and it should not be a requirement. But many want even more protection, so insurance companies have a tougher time of accessing the information. Robert Ray, Associated Press, Atlanta.